Can you imagine what a set looks like in the deepest sea or on the sea floor? Is it dark, cold, dead, and silent, or is something exciting happening? Today, let us go down to the deepest sea and talk about hydrothermal vent on the sea floor. A hydrothermal vent is a feature on the sea floor from which hot sea water issues. I'm very glad to have Delina here for us to talk about the hydrothermal vent. So, since you've been studying at the hydrothermal vent on Mariana Arc, can you tell us about where this moving hydrothermal vent occurs mostly? Yeah, these hydrothermal vents occur in um, divergent margins, as in East Pacific Rise and in convergent margins like Mariana's. Hydrothermal vent exists because the Earth's interior is hot and has large amount of water on its surface. As sea floor spreading, cold sea water percolates down into many cracks close to hot rock on the oceanic crust. The water gets heated and the hot water reacts chemically with the rock through which it flows. The hotter and more acid the water gets, the more minerals it can dissolve. So, as it heads up, it has also become rich in elements like iron, sulfides, and copper. Eventually, the mineral-rich seawater gets so hot that it becomes buoyant and rises back through the oceanic crust, where it escapes from the sea floor. Here, it may form a chimney, a smoker, and a hydrothermal plume. There are two main types of hydrothermal vent. The first, the most common one, the black smoker, and the other one is the white smoker. The main difference between the black smoker and white smoker is the temperature. Black smoker vents have temperatures of about 350 degrees, and the white smoker fluid is usually cooler of the temperature from 250 to 300 degrees and flows more slowly than the black smoker fluids. 